are famous for. Does anyone want to guess what that might be? Happy talking, that's right. Now, a lot of people think it's our bigger birds like the macaws that you've seen that make the better talkers. However, it's actually the smaller parrot species, like Eddie here. Eddie is our yellow crowned Amazon, and she's been working really hard for you guys. So, here she goes. All right, Eddie would like to start off by greeting everyone. Pretty cheerful little girl. Now she, as well, seems a bit excited to me. So Eddie, are you excited? So I love showing off for all of our guests. Now as Mary pointed out, her name is Eddie, and she doesn't know how to say that, but it comes with a little hello as well. That's one thing we hear often out of her. And then next thing is this next question. She is absolutely the most nosiest bird in our collection. needs to know what everybody's up to at all times of the day. Now by looking at her, you can't tell, but Eddie here is a female of her species. So how do I know? Well, it's because we relied on DNA testing. A simple drop of blood or even a feather to a lab, they can look at our parents' DNA and tell us whether or not their males are females. Eddie gave us a few good clues and results to come back. She was in fact a female Amazon parrot, always letting us know when one of our male Amazons are around. Right, likes the boy's attention. Well, flirting for her doesn't quite stop there. Next up comes the kiss. Very flirtatious young lady. She's also playful by nature because she's a parrot. They love to play games. What is Eddie's favorite game to play with their trainers? I think you might figure out what it is. Likes to be tickled. And when we do tickle her, of course she chuckles. You usually hear a few of those little laughs. Now one thing that parrots will often do is when they're living in an environment and hear the same sound over and over, they pick up on those sound effects. So here at the safari, in order for us to survive these nice hot days, we drink a lot of cold water. And what do we sell like that glass of water in hand? Good little chug -lugs. But she has a few songs to sing. We're gonna warm up her voice. Alright, perfectly in tune today. Now her first song is a bit of our national anthem as Eddie hatched right here in Canada. <laughs> Not too bad, Eddie. Alright, you're clapping, so it wasn't that bad after all. We're going to make you listen to one more song she's been working on, but before she gets going, I'd like you to raise your hand if it's your birthday today. No, no, no. Woo! Woo! Uh, we've got one over here. How about the month of July? It's going to be for you. Nice. A lot of summer ladies. Okay. Definitely not everyone's hand going up. How about raise your hand if you have a birthday coming up in the next year or so? Right, there we go, got y'all. Well, whenever your special day may be, and of course, if you're celebrating today, this lovely little tune is for all of you. All the words, none of the rhythm, but not too bad for a little green bird. Let's drink for Now here at African Lions Farm, we do believe that the first steps in conservation are education. So hopefully you've enjoyed meeting some birds. Maybe you've even learned a thing or two today. So we're bringing a couple of our birds up nice and close to the front now. So we can hopefully have you come on down, have a better look, and ask Now, before we do that, we'd like to remind everybody that around the corner in about 10 15 minutes will be our last bird of prey flying demonstration today. Don't forget to catch that as well as the rest of your day here on Safari. One last thing for that.